Grisha, we're going too fast. Dad, why are we out of town? Didn't you say you were going to show your hometown? Grisha, please, slow down! Dad! Son, circumstances have changed. I need to get home right away. Well, I don't want to be in Latvia. I want to stay here a little longer. Krisa, who's that? Easy, easy, easy. Mom, it's gonna be okay. Maybe it's not too late to call it off. Great, go ahead. I've already ferry decided. Now the notary and the buyer are coming. I'm not starting. Because as your legal advisor, I'd like to suggest that you reconsider. It's not the most favorable offer. And I don't have time to wait. Then how can I tell you as a friend? This house is the last memory of your parents. You grew up here, man. Well, it's your only property. Kostyan, you know I won't give up. Right business for sale. Good afternoon, Mr. Krug. Let me introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Stein, the buyers of your home. Marty, and you. Your new ID in the name of Ilya is a breeze. Congratulations. Cosmo, you're a piece of work. Why Ilya, the wind? Sounds like a chanson performer. Go on a little bit. But you don't have to change your name, just your last name. Okay, the keys are your new cars. I'll be waiting for you in the airport parking lot. I think these different risks. I'll have to fly out a day early to watch everything. Look, man, you're going to be very seriously scrutinized. So all personal belongings, all documents that would indicate your real life, must remain here. Do you understand? We checked everything before him. That's it. That's it. Are you sure? Yeah. Chuckles. Everything's fair game. The paperwork's all here. All right, Chuckles. We'll leave it in my office in the safe. Wait, I got that Sobolev baby waiver here. Oh, that's great. Okay, there, I told you. You'll forget that you haven't forgotten. All right, man. Let's try to wrap up alive. Let's go. Not bad. Well, from the south. Vitya, what the hell, huh? Marina, what are you doing here? You leave the house at the crack of dawn. First of all, calm down, huh? Listen, I have a very important day today. I need to focus, to be alone. Third, I don't have to tab a treat at all. That's no reason not to pick up the phone. Also, where's the money? What money? Money from the Foundation's account. Oh, of course. Why a wife might visit her beloved husband? Just for the money, huh? Did I just what? Try to transfer funds to buy new equipment for the hospital, and the account is zero. First of all, it's my money. I can spend it, just the way I want it, that's a first. Two, they spent it on my son's wedding. Do you know what your sister-in-law asked for? Violinist from Vienna. Ah? So you'll think about what's more important to you, your foundation and your son's wedding. After all, you don't have to twist it. You'll wait two days. 
and you'll lie to the press. The usual. You're used to it! What an asshole, you salt. I'm feeding you! Bastard! Talk to me at home. Look, this is gonna be the best wedding in Hema. Guest enemies, journalists, and archaeologists, straight up real ball. We should stop by another florist, pick a race. What are you doing? Is that okay? I'm sorry, for God's sake, I didn't notice. I bought a license to drive. Did you learn how to drive? We're safe, but we have to be careful. No, I was just staring. Yes, he did. You know, I'm about to hit someone. Olga, calm down. All right, come on. Let's go to work. Let's get me fired. Well, do you need a ride? Yes, laughs. Asshole. Flowing down the thin one. We'll sign an agreement with the investor tomorrow, get the dough. Let's buy those filters. No one will ever know that the honest ones didn't work. No, we need backups. A sniff of journalism and you're fucked, and I'm the wife. Maria turned a blind eye to such things. Look, don't give me that. Okay, all right. I'm working on it. I think about it, where isn't the night? At this commission from the grantors and we'll ask. Where's the money for clean facilities? And really... Where's the money, huh, Mr. Nar? You don't know? Good morning. Kirill Andreevich, Dad. Healthy. Sorry I'm late. Couldn't say no to Marwan's daughter. It's important. <laughs> Look, Badana, let me check. Sit, not mine. Lord, rest the souls of the servants. My father, my mothers, you have both the Son and the Holy One, the signs. Amen. Like, bless what I'm up to? Well, Mr. and Mrs. Krug, welcome. Hello, young man. Doctor, I hope you are with good news. Exclusively as follows. Ilya's analysis is very, very optimistic. Soon your son will actually be able to walk. Thank you. Did you hear that? Well, uh, Dad, if I was old enough, you'd take me with you. Son, I'm on my way to work. I promise, when I get back, we'll definitely go to Portugal. Look at the ocean. I want to go with you. And only you want to go to see your real parents. Am I right? I have only one parent. Or you and Dad. It would be interesting to see them. Ask them why they left me. Because I'm a co-worker. Ilyusha, you're not a co-worker. I'd like to come and show you. Look, you left me, and I can walk. Do not avenge yourself, beloved. And I will repay, says the Lord.
And yet, Dad, an outside investor is very creepy. What kind of man is this? Who knows? Is it possible to put him in the plant management right away? With a start. Security checked it out. Nothing in particular. Or me, the wind, for 30 years. He studied the chemical industry in the capital, then business school in England. The boy got tired of sitting around, started using his parents' money. Well, I decided to look for an adventure. And we'll give him an adventure. And his money is very much needed. I think I'm going to dig a little deeper. It's kind of nice. It's not true, it is. We're working on it. You know, I think I'm going to stay. I'll see what kind of bird it is. I've got a sniff of the underbelly. Yes. Dude, when are you coming? Good morning to you, too. The good kind. I've been at this Ren plant since the whole Chachu. Went all the way around? By the way, here's something interesting. So when can I expect you? Yeah, that's it. And this is where I come in already. Hello. Good afternoon. Are you following me? My name is Ilya Wind. I have an appointment with Vitor Arkeyevich. I'm an investor in your plant, and this is my lawyer, Kostya. Hello. Welcome to our production, Ilya Valerievich. Allow me your things. You're welcome. You're welcome. I'll do it. Victor Arsny, you've got one waiting for you. You're welcome. I'm rich at long last. So, uh, you want me to imagine? Kirill Alexeyevich, Mayor Gordokimska. I've come to meet you in person, so to speak. What honor? Heim's main enterprise spirits, but also for the whole area. So the attention of our entire administration is on him. Obviously mine too. So Bogdan Viktorovich sees the president of our enterprise. Ilya Valerievich. Can I just do it? It's very useful. Constantine Beach, my... Get really attached. So, what's up? Let's sit down. In the legs, really, no, as they say. It's cozy here. It's nice to meet connoisseurs of contemporary art. Oh, it's Krichevsky, if I'm not mistaken. My mom was in charge of decorating the office. I thought it wasn't ordinary, in fact. It turns out to be a contemporary artist. Well, we'll know. Well, okay, even if it's dry. So, tea, coffee? Coffee, please. Olenka? So, these are the investment plans that your dying plant is willing to put in. What makes you think he's dying? I'm sure you've made inquiries about me, so let's not. You're lucky I like a challenge. Well, if you're not ready to sign a contract right now, there's also an interesting venture in the neighboring area. Well, you know. Well, we're not the only candidate either. Bogdan. And Leva Levich. Excuse me, my son, he's still torturing. We have a very interesting condition. The first tranche, I am ready to transfer immediately after signing the contract. That's fine. But I need real control. Some kind of real position at this facility. Let it not be president, but at least vice president. Wait a second, wait a second. We already have a vice president. It's me. We don't need another. Well, the plants say otherwise. If the vice president had been working, the plant wouldn't be in such a financial hole. And Levich, what's the rush? 
Don't get us wrong. We are very interested in working with you. But even to draw up a contractual one, it will take at least a week. Isn't that right? Well, you don't have to worry. The contracts have already been drawn up. All that's left to do is sign it. Allow me. Ouch! I almost forgot. Ilya Valerievich. By the way, Sword, you're out of the way. Can we go to lunch? And we can continue our conversation there. I've got an official, so to speak, huh? All right. Chuckles. Konstantin Dmitrievich and I will take a walk, get used to it. And you're here to discuss, mull it over, or in an hour in the flower garden. And after lunch, I'm waiting for a definitive answer. Passed. Ilya Valerievich, I wanted to apologize for today's incident. I'm sorry, for God's sake. I really don't know what came over me. You're welcome. Don't forget the very thing. I have no idea what happened between you two. Well, personally. You see, please, in my chief's place in all things, how forgiven you are. I can see it in your eyes that I've forgiven you. But what if I haven't? Thank you. Believe me, I have a huge influence on him. Come on, I'm frying. Influence, sir. Have a nice day. Your earrings are very pretty, by the way. Under the eyes. Fiction. Thank you. Goodbye. I've already had three people in my ward with the same symptoms, and they all have respiratory problems. You do realize it's all the emissions from the heart angered plant. We need to inform the horde. Listen, Andrei Yurievich, let you do your job and I'll do mine. You want me to treat the case? I'll decide who and what to report to. Please go to work. Ed. What is this? What? Why aren't you ready? The journalists have already gathered. Come on, get dressed quickly. I'm waiting. Just let me make you some coffee. Come on, I've got cognac, so just a little bit. What, Yacha? Are you kidding me? You're suggesting that I should be drunk in front of reporters. Okay. So, what did he do again? Nothing. It's none of your business. So I'm right. All right. Chuckles, now you change. Let's go downstairs. Bogdan, you're not a little kid anymore. You're the vice president of the plant, after all. Uh-huh. Almost an X. Temporarily, temporarily. So you don't have to mold everything in your head. Think. Think a hundred times before you say it. Look, Dad, if you're so smart, then what's the ass plant? What do you know? All right, son. I don't like this investor either. But we need the money. I need the money badly. Everybody doesn't need one. What if he finds out what you're using the money for? And at the same time, how much was stolen here and by whom? Blah, 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 blah. Dad, can you, don't you get it? I'm not going to give up my seat. I think you're the one who didn't realize that no one is asking you anything at all. Maybe you should work as a production manager so you can learn the ropes, asshole. Victor's all witch. A word of advice. Come on. Talking to my future son-in-law like a little kid. Blagadam is in a position to make an informed decision that settles everything. Yes. Of course, if it's temporary. That's the right thing to do. Good for you. He's a good guy. Let's have a drink because I'm starting to feel a little woozy. Good afternoon, dear friends. I am pleased to welcome you to our regional hospital. We are here today to thank our wonderful, lovely Marina Soboliva and her foundation. It was Marina Soboliva who gave us the opportunity to equip a family room. Now our women can be more comfortable with their newborn baby and husband. Thank you, Pavel Olegovich. Well, actually,
actually, you deserve credit for that too. Pavel Olegovich consulted us, and we chose the most modern equipment. By the way, a young family with a newborn daughter has already settled in the new ward. Yes. By the way, a little closer, please. Yeah, chuckles. There you go. Yeah, I'm not having his baby. I hate him. I can't stand to see him. Sometimes. Who knew? Well, I'll give you a service polia hello. Take me to another hospital. Come on. We went out with Pasha. It's been and gone. Look, I mean, does it really matter? What matters now is that you gave birth. Vidya, find me another doctor. You find me. Where do you want me at night? I'll find another doctor. Pashka, the journal. You'll be looking for another one for a long time. I don't want to calm down. You! You're a soul. Can you tell me why the second shipment was sent? Is it because of a problem at your husband's plant? What? And you're on the subject of continued procurement and indeed had to be put on hold. But it's literally just for a couple days. It's because of sick workers. The money went towards their treatment. Marina Vladislavna, is it true that the chemical plant your husband runs is poisoning the whole town? Dear friends, I just want to say, if you want to still catch the happy married couple before they are discharged, please follow me. By the way, there is a young mom in this family board, so you can communicate with her. Come, come with me. Why do I have to save your husband's skins all the time? Come on in. Please, please. Hello. Please, come in. Come on in. I am pleased, gentlemen, at this promising co-creation. Well, in honor, so to speak, of signing a mutually beneficial contract. You're invited to the banquet. So to speak, we should celebrate the deal is a must. I'll think about it. What's to think? A restaurant in the same hotel where you're staying? We have joy. My daughter is marrying Bogdan, and in honor of the engagement, we're having a small banquet. Well, we're not saying goodbye. I'll see you tonight. Congratulations. All good things. Congratulations. Goodbye. You should have invited them. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> Look, what's the timing? These fell drew sun dough, or God forbid, it's the commission, digging up. What are the facts of our light has passed? I'll tell you, our past is in the past. Grishka circle perish heavenly. Except for him, there's no witness left. Unless, of course, you count that mush doctor. What about you? In my pocket. What are you? What are you? Don't sit on my desk. Bad luck. Well, I'm Valerovich, darling. Let's have some champagne. Yeah, genius meeting. Noticed what beautiful, beautiful girls there are in this town. It's a joy to behold. By the way, the food is delicious. I found this one diner not too far away. Five minutes from the hotel. You get the champagne out and the glasses, which is normal again. I ran in a castaway plastic, but the most important thing is the attitude. I'll put a smile on his face for you, and a kind word. And most importantly, a cook. Cooking so what? Just fingers, and you're getting closer. Where do you have a place to get one here? Wash your hands, huh? Well, there, I'm literally minutes again. Now listen, not carefully. You realize who we're dealing with, don't you? It's a bandit. I realized this back at the deal, but the bug is proof of that. 
This is one I found right now, and it's not known how many by number. Anyway, we don't talk business in the room, but we can't keep quiet either. It's suspicious. Anyway, all plans change. You never leave my side, not one step. I'm with you all the time. You wanted to go to Riga tomorrow. You're in business, aren't you? Things to do, things to do, but they'll wait. See what a mess. I realized today that it was Sobol who took the team, who caused this accident. Well, it's understandable that a special character would go under a corpse for profit. And why exactly did he decide to take it out on the traffic circle? That's what I'm trying to find out. Yeah, it's some kind of financial issues anyway. The accident was set up after your father represented the bank at the forum. Thanks for telling me. Because I didn't know. Yeah, and we need to find out about it from Shu Sabalev's secretary. Like, yeah, a girl. Maybe they're lovers. Is she into you, by the way? Yes. I've seen what she's got. The brilliance must have been a gift from some of hell. Maybe Sobole himself. Uh, by the way. All right, bro, let's go. It's suspicious. You remember you're there. So take it, you got it? No, I'm waiting for you. Open it. Let's drink to our deal. So that everything goes well. Just like clockwork. Come on. Whether you're a professional or not, what do you mean you didn't find anything? No, nothing on him. Sterile is your wind. Sterile cats only come in sterile. So you didn't look hard enough for the grove. I may not limit myself in my methods. Do whatever you want. But, to get my puppy on it, I found as much as I could, to find everything. Okay, got it. Come on. Wiki. Where are you going? Dressed up? Like where? Yes, the banquet? What don't I like? So I don't see you in the bank and I don't hear you. You got it? I'll show. It's at work for you, Viktor Arsevich. You got it? Viktor Arsenik, remember? Viktor Arsenik? Can you give me a ride, please? And so, Cedar. You've chosen a very difficult piece. Sonata Akmanova is not given to every musician. What? Sorry, I didn't realize you appreciated classical music. Insult me. I love Ra Ra and they have been listening to you since childhood. I especially like the Senator. B flat minor, if I'm not mistaken. It's just so offbeat and nice to meet someone in Kemsky who shares my tastes. That's no longer a SIM card. Yes and no. I was born here, but I live in the capital. That's why, when I come to my favorite city, I want to talk to someone about music. Well, I'm willing to accompany you to any city to talk to you about music. By the way, I can play a little bit too. By the way, 
I didn't introduce myself. My name is Ilzia, Wind. Dina? Very much, hi. So, uh, about... <laughs> Undermine. I want to apologize to you again for almost running over your friend. How is she, by the way? You didn't get fired? Thank you. It's okay. Dina, why don't you keep me company in a cup of coffee? You know, I would... I'd love to, but I'm playing at a banquet tonight, and I have to learn this passage. Well, I can keep you company on that one, too. I apologize but I still have time to change. So what? What when we don't say goodbye? Because I'm going to invite you to this party too. See you tonight. Yes, you are. You? You take care too, Pavel Olegovich. Come in, will you? They won't let you. Are you alone? Well? Come on, I don't drink. Did you know that three other workers were poisoned at the factory? Bursa. They're in the ICU and mine in Russia are pumped up. Yeah, I came here. Only to tell me what I already know. Yes? Why'd you become such a fighter, huh? Are you serious? Oh, really? And I'm sick of covering for you. I won't do it again. I don't want to. I have it sitting right here. Do you even know what the initial reminiscence department wanted to DHS today? Yes, yes. Hit it! Pasha, and you're restraining your subordinates. Why did we put you in charge of this chapter? Hit it! Don't piss me off! Don't piss me off. Don't piss me off! You'll do it. I'm not studying. Obstetricians and gynecologists. I don't care. Yes. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Look, what, what? Bangs? Who, who did this to him? Come on, come on. Guys, that's field, that's field, that's field, that's field. Bronica, he can't be the one that is. Alibi, I remembered you're in med school. Come on, Pasha, he's talking from the screen. Listen, I'm paying attention, Pashka. We're not going to get you anywhere else anyway. So it's in your best interest to patch up our friend. Or will you both be swimming in the river? All right, all right, all right. I need to boil some water, per the realization of the knife, and I'll try to get the bullets out. Come on, come on. Guys, guys, he's not breathing. What's that? The care of our friendship is soaking wet. I told you to go to the hospital. Lost a lot of blood. Whoa! What's this? Pashka? Marinka, use the pole. Marinka brought it. Here we go. You stay. There you go. All right. All right, chuckles. That's it. You made your own grave. Here you go. Get dressed, and Pashenka, you'll drive the car. Pashka, you know what for me, don't you? Little one, I like yours. You haven't seen her around. You got it, piece of shit. I got something on you, too. The Hacienda certainly won't like it. 
Do you want me to remind you of something, Pasha? In 20 years, you've helped write off five, and the proof remains. So you'll keep quiet and write the correct diagnosis. And of course, you don't want to send it. Also, tonight at the banquet, you have to be sane. You'll be chatting with reporters, smiling, saying nice things to Albany and Mary. Posh, stop drinking. I think it's going to go modestly. In moderation and with the closest of friends. What's the budget for the wedding? A small one. Like Kem's budget. Just kidding. We know that there was a chemical release at the factory of which your matchmaker is president. The ecology of the city has suffered, and it is said that even children are not advised to go out on the streets. Another informational image. And yet, residents of the city have repeatedly seen an ambulance near the plant. Yes, gentlemen, I was personally at the plant and everything was quickly sorted out. Turns out two workers were hurt because of safety violations. Their personal irresponsibility led them to the hospital slide. If you'll excuse me, I need to talk to my daughter prior to the event. Thank you all. Help yourself. Marie, you look great. Well, it's gone. Then he's bored. <laughs> you scared me. You know, I don't like crowds either. Well, why'd you go there? Well, just so you can see it. Here, in these mind-blowing surge. Wait, 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 wait. What the hell is that? May I? Go on, darlings, you could probably use that money to run a whole week's hospital ward. Ah? Huh? That's it, that's it, that's it. Well, I'm sorry, well, it's not meaty creepy. Pasha, you'd better go and sleep it off. I'll make you a Seneca. Hey, what are you doing with me? Yeah, Hippo's bothering me. Look, it's not easy. Stay. I mean... You'll get tired if you see me off. That's when Pasha will do it. Or do you have plenty of doctors ready and willing to sign the right deeds? Hey, how come we didn't? Come on, loosen up. Give me a break, too. Our kids are such an event. Okay, to the kids. Dad, don't embarrass yourself. Come on. Come on. I'm asking you to eat something. With that greeting, a piece of the out-of-throat field. Really, it's a snail's eye. Come on, all of you, serving. Here's a thought with your remarks. You want some? Daddy! Daddy, daddy, yeah. Chuckles. Thank you. 
Yeah, we're coming. Three, Rach. Good to see you on our links. Decide, you bet. My wife Marin was glorious. And here's Leva Levich, our investor. And this is Konsoni Demijevic, his Juris Consul. It's a pleasure. You're off the beam wire in the city. Be sure to visit our art museum. Museum? Lev Valerievich, maybe you need a drink? No, I'll be a little later. I think I've had a drink. I will definitely visit the Recon Museum. Olga Pavla, I'm just blinded. I'm in the early heart. I feel like I might even have to get my dad some medical attention. Looking at your dress and the paintings you chose in your spouse's study, I doubt if you have feelings perfectly. Yes, the one who pays for this beautiful. Which was unfortunate. How are you settling in? Number. Have you met my father? Id. Well, then we can only hope that you don't give those compliments to all girls. Well, only the most beautiful ones. And whose father is a doctor. Dear guests, this is a stunning evening. You should be aware that all of these beautiful and important people are here for a reason. They are here for an important and serious event, the engagement of the young people. All right, everybody. Meet me. Meet me. Bogdan Adina.